Creek is known for having some great galleries with some gorgeous art, and I am here with the absolute best of them, the largest art gallery in the valley, the C. Anthony Gallery, and I am here with Kyle. How are you doing this morning? I'm fantastic, thank you. How are you? Yeah, man, it's been a gorgeous day. Things have finally heated up a little bit. It was slightly chilly this morning. Yeah, absolutely. We've got yeah. some uh, beautiful aspens behind us, so. Right? Isn't this time, time of year, year great? Ah, it's yeah. so perfect. Yeah, man. So tell me a little bit about C. Anthony Gallery. So we're the largest gallery in the valley. Mm -hmm. uh, we feature over 35 artists on display, and we're over 5,000 square feet of all kinds of different art. We've got sculpture from you know, desk-sized bronzes all the way up to life-size. Yeah. Uh, we actually just opened a uh, uh, sculpture-specific gallery oh, back cool. in November. In the same sort of area? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we have six distinct galleries. Each one kind of has its own feel or, uh, you know, taste, if you will. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we've got a little bit of everything for all kinds of different collectors. So. Okay. So it's kind of like going to an art museum that you can buy the pieces from. Very much so, yeah. yeah. We've got uh, artists that, you know, some of the bigger names, Dolly, Picasso, you know. You have Picassos? Yeah, Zakharov. We've got... You know, definitely some of the more infamous names. We've also got some local artists in there as well. So yeah. there's uh, definitely quite a wide variety of, you know, of, of art for everybody. So. Yeah. Awesome, man. And do you, so we are in like fall and leaf changing season now, and then we're going to get to winter. Do you like change oh, yeah. things up to match the season? <laughs> Absolutely, we do. We've got uh, some beautiful Aspen uh inspiration works up right now yeah um, you know some of those fall colors obviously a lot of people are looking for that sort of thing right now with the inspiration uh, out here in nature but uh yeah we we definitely change it up uh you know we'll get some ski art out here in a couple months with the with the uh change of the seasons and winter coming so it's always uh, always exciting always something new on the wall yeah i always love that ski art when it comes in especially the old like vintage style oh, yeah. professional so it kind of looks like an old poster but it's all vintage really you got some of that oh yeah definitely yeah. yep we've got uh, a little bit of everything <laughs> okay well yeah i mean six different rooms that's so impressive what's your what's your favorite room what's the one that people should check out if they're going in the first time um i really personally like more the modern stuff okay um you know obviously a lot of the homes up here kind of go in that mountain modern feel so yeah you, know, you can you can tie a splash of color into a kind of a minimalistic designed room and mm -hmm. and uh, really bring that pop into the room and make it a focal point yeah and you uh, we were chatting earlier you mentioned you had some consultants in there if you're somebody that's not quite sure what art is appropriate for like a mountain modern or an old log cabin thing you guys can help out with that right yeah absolutely we have four full-time consultants um, so we're always there to you know help our clients whether mm -hmm. that's you know someone that's you know trying to check out their first piece and and really get started in the art world or someone that's a seasoned veteran yeah. um, with a huge collection you know we can we can cater to all those people and another uh, very helpful thing that we do as well is we're actually able to digitally impose work so oh. if someone has a oh. photo of a space that they're saying you know oh, we're not quite sure what to put here yeah. we can actually place something in there digitally to scale show them what it's going to look like and that's a really really helpful tool because obviously it's a visual sport yeah absolutely <laughs> yeah there's nothing better than experiencing the piece in your own home. I know there's a lot of augmented reality going on in the App Store. Maybe that's something you guys look into. It's super cool. Um, so where are you guys located here in Beaver Creek? Uh, we're right here in the gallery promenade, just kind of adjacent to the uh, ice rink. So if you go down that hallway, we're on both sides. So yeah. you really can't miss it. Okay. And any special hours for this off season? Uh, we'll we'll trim down a little bit, but we're still open every day. Yeah. Um, usually like 10 to 6 right now. So okay. yeah. Plenty of time. Uh, yeah, Plenty of time absolutely. to come in there after a hike and check out some good arts. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. And then one final thing. What's a, what's a good website? Because I'm sure you've got a good preview yeah. of the pieces that you have. Absolutely. So it's art at C. Anthony. Okay. And uh, that's going to be our website. And all of the available work is on there. We've, Like I said, we've got 35 artists. There's thousands of, of uh, different works. And yeah. you can inquire on there, you know, what what pieces catch your eye, and we'll send you more information. Perfect. Well, thank you very much, Kyle. I appreciate yeah. you coming on today. Thank you. Yeah. Definitely check out the C. Anthony Gallery. It's like a museum with pieces you can buy. You can pass that art down to future generations. Definitely check that out if you're up here in Beaver Creek. Now, coming up next, we've got a quick wrap on what's coming up tomorrow on Good Morning Vale. Stick around.